and I want you to explain it to me. All right. Uh, so here we have a circular disc that is attached to a Lazy Susan bearing, which makes it this spin around. Let me see it spin. Okay, well, that doesn't do much except spin around. Yep. And the way we look this up, this is called a zoetrope. Hmm. Zoetrope, not zoetrope. A lot of people get that mixed up. Um, so what we have here attached to our flashlight, which I will explain in a minute, is a reed switch, which we have down there. You can't see it, but it's down underneath yeah, there. Yeah, it's down underneath there. And what a reed switch does is a reed switch uh, turns on a circuit when it is touched by or it feels a magnet in its area. So it's a magnetic switch. So it's a magnetic switch, basically. Okay, and that does what? And this is going to turn on our flashlight. Turned on, let me see. And so it, as, that, as that goes around, let me see. So as it goes around, it flashes the flashlight. Okay, so the, the magnets under there are turning that flashlight on and off? Yes, that magnets, there are 36 magnets and also 36 pencils on this zoetrope and 36 dots. Okay. And now we are going to turn this flashlight on and spin this and you will see a magical show. Not magical, but it looks magical. Makes the pencils grow and, and, and not grow. Let me, I want you to go turn off the light and let's see if it works without the light on. Oh, that's that went dark. All right, give her a spin. Whoa, animation, baby, animation. Look at that. And what? All right, I'm going to go turn the light back on. And what the flashlight does to make the pencil stand out um, is what it does is that um, the light acts as the shutters to uh, a zoetrope, which we have over there, that. and a feed and kiss -scope. Well, Let's see your feed and kiss -scope. Oh. All right, so how does that work? So place the camera through the slots. Yeah. And now I'm going to spin this. Hopefully that's not uh, too fast. Let's get it over in the light. I can't, really can't see anything. But you will see a man and woman dancing. Let's get your hand off to the side, about yep. like that. Let's see if we can see them dancing. Not really. But. Oh, there we go. You will see them dancing, which yep. is cool. And so and that is that is. This is the show. Me, show me how that works. So this is. Take it over there so I can see it. I can't. You're too close right. to the camera. Okay. So, so what this, have you got there? You got a disc with shutters in it. Oh, the disc slots with slots. It which act as shutters and then over here did you do um, all those drawings no and who did that we printed them off the off the internet and a very famous animator called ed or er, named edward Muybridge um did all these uh paintings and drawings and many other things um he did so let's see let's spin it one. around normal all right so i'm going to spin it around normal it's uh, just like a blur. It's a blur. Let me move over here and, and look through the shutter, and I see people dancing. Yes. Very cool. All right, so let's take this over here. Duh. And so this is what the flashlight does. It is every time the ma the magnet, um, the reed switch reads the, the magnet, the magnet will turn on the light, which Every time the pencil goes by, the light will shine, and it takes it, and since you're looking at the light, basically, and focusing on that one pencil, it, you will see the, mo the pencil basically stop. So it stops the motion for a so second. So it stops the motion, but it actually is spinning. And you seem to get smoother motion the faster you go? Yes, because more frames per second go by. I don't know how many frames per second that is, but it's, <laughs> it's a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> That's probably running. They'll say it's probably going two circuits in a second. And and look, if it, if you're flashing slow, it just looks like it's turning. I don't I don't see any animation there. So there's four or five frames a second, 
Okay, and then we get faster and faster. Now I can start, now I can begin to see animation. Now I can begin to see animation. 24. And there we go. There we go. We get up to 48, which is what they shot the Hobbit in, right? It looks very simulationist. Okay. Well, that's that's a good job. And your name is? Who are you? Edward Murraybridge. <laughs> you are. I thought you were. I thought you were. <laughs>